Hey guys, Gunshy Mori back here with another video. So today I am going to be reviewing the Duck Ducks Hive and Swarm. So we're just gonna hop straight into it here. So here are the hive creatures. I've been calling them hive carriers because that seems kind of like what they mo more are because the swarm is in them, I believe. But they are known as the hive creature. And if we quickly go and just get a up close look here at it as you can see it is a four-legged uh creature <laughs> uh, definitely insect like it's got these little like little pockmark things on its side which i believe are supposed to be like yo that's where the swarm comes out of and then it has a head which is very reminiscent of i guess the blood stalker and the swarmer so yeah and I do believe this is based off of some concept for Ark. Like, this was originally something they might have made. But anyways, this is the normal variant. This will spawn in the dunes and, the, and in the desert canyons as well. So, the only maps that these uh, hive creatures will not spawn on are Lost Island and Ragnarok. They have stated that on the mod page. But this one... Right here will spawn in the dunes and in the desert canyons. So he, he'll spawn on a good portion of maps, just not Lost Island and Extinction. So if we move on from him, which we go to the albino, which will spawn in the snow, snow caves and uh, ice caverns, I believe. And so what he is, is basically a stronger version of the normal one. So what the albino one is, is it's just, its attacks have some special effects on them, such as its bite slows and freezes, and its slash does a bleeding effect. In which, yes, this would be definitely the more preferred one. I'm not 100% sure if the albino is tameable, but I'm pretty sure it is. So, I'm pretty sure it's also tamed is the same way as the regular one. But ones that are tamed slightly different are the X variant here. In which, this one came out with some beautiful colors. I did a photo shoot with it for the thumbnail. So, yeah, luckily, he came out pretty good looking. In which, him and the normal variant still have the same kind of normal pattern, you know. I've been seeing this. I don't know if you guys see it, but I see a rock golem smiling. But yeah, the, then the albino one doesn't have its own. It doesn't have any color regions as well. Is what I've, or Well, it does. It just doesn't have any visible. But yeah, then we got him. He came out pretty nice. This is the X variant. So if we quickly swap it over to uh, be dark here, he will be glowing. In which all of their eyes glow. and But he his entire body glows because he spawns on Genesis Part 1. In the lava biome, in which he looks awesome. I hope that they also add in a swamp variant of the X, maybe. So that way, uh, yeah, it's just that way, because that's where I feel like I always ran into the swarm. The swarms was in the swamp. Or wh whatever they were. They, I guess they're not the swarms. They were like the... I forget what they are. But you guys probably know what they are. They, like, attacked you a lot, and, like, you just had to punch the air to get rid of them. I believe... I don't I don't remember what those guys are. It's been a while since I played Genesis Part 1, so... Anyways, on to the last one, which is the R variant, which will spawn over in Rockwell's Garden on Genesis Part 2. And in which it's not... It does differ from them and the pattern on its back in which it is, like, dotted. As you can see here, we got... We got big pink dots and little blue dots all over the gray body. So, yeah. They all spawn in swarmers as well. I don't know why I flew so high there, but if I quickly uh, pop out a, a saddle here for the hive. Uh, go. And, you know what, let's just throw it on the regular one here. And what the swarm are, are its kind of special attack, in which, if you hit right trigger, they will pop out like so. Um, I kind of wish Gigoraptor would have made it uh, the C button here to attack. 
Which, the C is the simple bite, but I believe if, like, C should probably be uh, the right trigger, to be honest. Because it, it feels weird having to hit C to bite. But then if I hit left tr trigger here, they do a swipe attack. And if I hit space, they do a little jump. But here's the one that I found quite annoying. And I'm glad that they no longer make this sound in the wild, because oh my god. I had three of these next to uh, where I was doing a video the other day, and it was so loud. But if you hit the O button... Yes, that that is the sound for their taunt right now. I mean... It works. You don't expect it coming. But anyways, yeah, so... I've shown you guys them. Now let's get on how you tame them. So if I just quickly go down here towards the desert. Here, uh, let's spot some. I highly doubt we're going to spot some right away. But there are, are several things you can feed these guys to tame them. You can feed them wyvern cheese, which is something new the mod added, I believe. Which is four wyvern milk and five salt to make. There's one right there. But yeah. The other ones, such as the X variant, you can feed them uh, Ambergris. And for the R variant, it's Mutagen. So, let's get right up on this guy real quick. And we are going to get him tamed. So, make sure you pop a bug repellent. So that way you uh, can get close to the bug without the swarm coming out. Because from what I've noticed right now, the mod is a little bugged in the sense that the swarm can't be hurt by anything else except another swarm so if i just quickly run up on him here like so hopefully he doesn't get triggered and i quickly shove some wire and cheese in him that is how you tame them they are a passive tame they are not a knockout so you are going to have to run up on them and do that so yeah I do got one more thing I want to show you guys here for the this mod, and that is the boss. In which, I'm not too sure if it spawns, if I can get it to spawn on this map. But if I hit 6 and hit OK. You around here? Because I've, no, I've, I've noticed it doesn't spawn directly in front of you sometimes. I heard it. Uh, I'll get right back to you. So, alrighty guys, so I've swapped over here to Scorched Earth, so if I hit 1 and hit Accept, and, uh, does it not spawn? Oh, there it is. I'm guessing that's it. So it spawns near you, but it looks like it's, yeah, it spawns right out of sight. So if I run over here. We'll get a quick look at it. So I just spawned in the Gamma variant. And it appears to spawn in some larger variants of the Swarmers, which are known as Rogue Swarm. Ooh, they, they can soon... Like, yeah, as, like, as you can see, you can't even heart the Swarm. Like, at all. But if I go down here, here's the Queen. I did notice some other things spawn. Where'd those go? Oh, these. Alright, what are these called? Oh, they're all right. So they're just scaled up the hive, the hive, uh, you know, hive carriers. I'm gonna say it. <laughs> they're just scaled up versions of the hive carrier, just like the boss, the hive. What is it? What was this called? The hive mind, I believe. But yeah, let's uh quickly drop her here with the tech or with the admin gun and see what we get. So we get uh the trophy. We get a trophy some element and just some simple other stuff um you know what let's spawn in the alpha variant and see what we get from her are you the alpha yes so we're gonna scale it up a bit bit here and uh right and go a bit away and land so it does appear that you can only spawn these on a uh, scorched earth right now as well where oh there she is so, yeah, it's just a red variant of it. Looks like all of her stuff's... She definitely spawned in a lot more stuff. Looks like they're all heading to go kill something, though. So, 
We drop her, you get 105 element and just a trophy. And I think, yeah, I think he should probably, uh, think I will let Giga Raptor know that he should probably bust some of the drops from her. But again, though, this is new. It's only been out for two days. So do remember there are bugs such as you can't kill the swarm that are currently swarming me. But anyways, yeah. So those, that's the Hive and, that's Duck Duck's Hive and Swarm by Giga Raptor. So... Let's just get over here and do an outro real quick. So as you guys know, leave a like and subscribe if you guys want to see more ARC. And this has been Gunshy Mori signing off. Peace. I love the chase and the hunt and I set the pace when I'm running I always take what I want and I always give it 100 Don't need a bank, no I'm funded Play the game like it's